We have just landed at Hong Kong International Airport and I will provide you with a few tips about landing at Czech Lab Cook Airport as it is also called. When you arrive at the immigration at the airport you will need your passport and a completed arrival card. Some airlines supposedly hands out arrival cards during the flight but we did not get any at our flight with the flag carrier of Hong Kong, the Cathay Pacific Airline. But you can get arrival cards when you get to the immigration. Just make sure you have a pen available so you don't have to go around looking for one. Once off the plane you just follow the crowd as everybody has to pass the immigration. I did not film at the immigration. I do think the airport officials prefer that you do not film during the immigration process. The arrival in Hong Kong went without any kind of problems. Okay, the immigration process is done and I did some research before my trip and there is one thing that is very useful to have in Hong Kong and that is the octopus card. The Octopus card is a prepaid debit card that you can use to pay for different kind of items and services around in Hong Kong. You can use it to pay for transportation, light shopping, food and all sorts of activities. It's a must have in Hong Kong. and You can pre-order the Octopus card online so that it will be ready for you to pick up when you arrive at the airport. I pre-ordered my Octopus card from Kluke. It was pre-loaded with 50 Hong Kong dollars, so it was ready for use. I will post a link in the description below for you to find the Kluke webpage. The free Wi-Fi at the airport was not much help as I could not load any web pages or apps. But I had pre-ordered a SIM card as well from Kluke and I picked it up together with my Octopus card. The pickup location of Klug is close to the arrival point, so it is easy to get both the octopus card and the SIM card. Just ask at the tourist information where to pick it up. From the airport you can get to your destination by train, bus or taxi. What form of transportation is best depends on your destination and how much luggage you have with you. If you have already picked up your preloaded octopus card, you are ready to pay for your transportation with the card. I had planned ahead and went outside to take the bus and pay for it with my octopus card. I will make a separate video of how I plan my stay in Hong Kong and the transportation I chose from Hong Kong International Airport to the city. The buses from the airport are quite comfortable and they are double deckers so you can enjoy the view from the top deck. But I had too much luggage so I decided against it as I did not want to bring everything up the narrow staircase. The bus trip to the city was quite enjoyable. I got on the bus around 9am and there was not much traffic on the roads. The weather was nice and for me, as a first time visitor to Hong Kong, there were a lot of interesting things to look at. I will be posting many videos from Hong Kong. Make sure you subscribe to the Happy and Away channel and you will be notified when I post a new video. I will also post a separate video of how to plan for Hong Kong and you do not want to miss that if you are planning to visit Hong Kong yourself. 
We are getting closer to the city and I keep track on where I am with the GPS on my smartphone thanks to the SIM card from Klug. The bus driver did not speak much English, so I did not get much assistance of where to get off the bus. But the GPS helped me to get off at the closest stop to my hotel. The arrival in Hong Kong at Hong Kong airport went as smooth as it could have done. No problems or issues at all. Make sure you get to see the next videos of me exploring Hong Kong. Subscribe now to the Happy In A Way channel. I will also be posting videos from Macau, which I also visited during my stay in Hong Kong. After Hong Kong, I flew on to the Philippines and will be posting many videos from there as well. At the Happy and Away channel, you can already find many videos from Thailand. Click on the red button below and subscribe to the Happy and Away channel for more videos like this one. Or press on the Happy and Away logo on the screen right now to subscribe to the Happy and Away channel.